The world works in so many mysterious ways. Think about it, the way Max Verstappen has driven this season. I don't care if people want to disagree, okay? He hasn't driven like a Formula One driver. He hasn't. Formula One is precise, it's accurate. Everything is, every piece of the car, all the engineering, everything is pristine, precise. It's not any other kind of motorsport. It's formula motorsport. It's precise and accurate. Max Verstappen is kamikaze. It's a non-contact sport. Okay? That's Formula One. Max Verstappen doesn't drive like a Formula One driver. And it's shown all season. The way he has driven and his attitude and how he has been for this season. The way he won it is how he deserves to win it. He deserves to be given it in a very unfair way where it's just blatantly obvious you haven't deserved that win. That's showing the world how Max Verstappen won that championship shows how he deserves to win a championship from how he's driven throughout the season because he has been dirty and dangerous. He has. There is no denying it. Nobody can argue against that. I could display many occasions where Max Verstappen has been dangerous and where Max Verstappen has been dirty. On many occasions throughout this season. Lewis Hamilton has been the better driver throughout the season. Better than Max Verstappen. He's been entertaining. But he's been Mad Max. Kamikaze Max. He's been crazy. He hasn't driven like a Formula One driver. And people love that kind of thing. A rogue guy comes in like Happy Gilmore. Max Verstappen is the Happy Gilmore of Formula One. I can't believe I've never thought of that before now. Max Verstappen is the Happy Gilmore of Formula One. That's what it is. That's what it is. And he should have grown out of that by now. Because when new drivers come in, they're a bit, they're, they are a bit hardcore. They are. But it's not how you're supposed to drive a Formula One car. And he should have been told by the FIA and put in line. He should have been, but he hasn't been. And it's been allowed to happen all season. He hasn't been controlled. He's been allowed to be a rogue driver. Mad Max has been allowed to be that. And he, he doesn't deserve to win the Formula One World Championship. And if he did, that's how he deserves to win it. And that's why it happened like that. So when it first happens, all the emotions are out there. And it's like, what are they doing? How? Like, they did really... They ripped Lewis Hamilton off, man, big time. They ripped him off. But Formula One is a rip-off. We all know Formula One's a rip-off. The tickets are extortionate. Sky Sports, 10, so is it over £10 a month? Everything about Formula One is it's a rip-off. And they ripped off Lewis Hamilton. But, putting all that aside, about that Lewis Hamilton thing, Max Verstappen is going to win the World Championship. That's how he deserved to win it. By cheating. Because Max Verstappen has been a cheat this season. He has. He's cheated. Look at Brazil. Look at Saudi Arabia. And his other ones. He's been dangerous. Look where he drove over the top of Lewis Hamilton's car. Crazy. Crazy, he's been entertaining, but he's, he's crossed the line and all the pundits have not said anything. They've been quiet about it. They've been sugarcoating it all season. And even at the end where Lewis Hamilton was blatantly robbed, the pundits have stood there and had the nerve to just, just wishy-washy over it. Unbelievable. The amount of people that I lost respect for Nearly all of them, to be honest. Nearly all of them. I couldn't believe how nobody addressed the situation and nobody really said anything and just made eye it was okay. 
and I don't know what more I can say right now, so I'm out of here.